Um, as I said, I'm from Dublin, but um, when I was a, a teenager, my family moved to America uh, and they had some quite strange ideas in New York of what was life was like back in the old country. Uh, so this is a poem about that, and it's called um, Home a Home. I'm 11 when my family moves to America, the greatest country on earth, according to my teachers, who speak to me very slowly and very loudly and tell me my English is really very good and think I'm just being cute when I tell them it doesn't want to be, seeing as how I don't speak anything else. The dozen words I can remember of my grandfather's native tongue hardly counting as a language. But even our friends insist on believing we used to live in a tiny cottage with no TV or toilet, just adorable little piggies running around the kitchen by candlelight. And they laugh when we tell them we come from the city. Cities in Ireland? Don't be ridiculous. And ask if we've ever been to school before. And if we're refugees from the war. <laughs> Me and my brother decide to educate them with a game we invent called Of Course We Speak Gaelic, where we pretend to have huge passionate rows in Irish that actually consist of entirely made up nonsensical words. <laughs> our friends listen in fascination as we hurl insults at each other with our legendary Celtic tempers and beg to be told the translation of our epic family drama. But we insist it's too personal, too primitive for their sensitive, <laughs> civilized ears. And we always reconcile with the one piece of genuine Irish we actually know. Home, my home, we say sweetly. It means I love you. <laughs> and we get them to practice it over and over, never revealing that the literal translation is kiss my ass. <laughs>